Welcome back to my channel, my name's Liv. I'm a 26 year old first time mum to my tornado toddler Arlo, who's almost three. It's no secret that I've loved motherhood but struggled immensely with a lot of the things that come with it, like the constant cycle of mess. So every week I post one cleaning motivation video and one mum vlog on YouTube to connect with others who are feeling the same, show realistic raw motherhood, cleaning motivation, mum life tips and ideas. We've just finished a declutter series on my channel, but today we're starting a fresh new series that is going to be focusing on deep cleaning and organizing. So if that's your sort of thing, I would absolutely love to have you. Make sure you tap that subscribe button if you haven't already and strap your seatbelts in because we're going in for a ride. These heatless curlers are a mum's best friend. They've been amazing. I've been trying to also just do like a little bit, even just really minimal makeup each morning. And I found it's just been a huge benefit. It's like made me more productive as well. Just feel more put together. So little man's getting out of the house and then we're gonna whack that timer on and try and get as much done as possible. A little tip that I would say as well that's really changed the game for me is when you're in a room, like if you're making a cup of coffee, a cup of tea, just clean down the side, like just do one job whenever you enter a room and that will just make your life so much easier and then things just don't build up as quickly. So I'm just cleaning down the side now whilst the kettle is going and then I'm just gonna enjoy coffee and some breakfast. Different planets, watch your aura pass me by, losing balance. What if we were out of time and second chances? Just getting my shark hoover out, I've actually named him Bruce. And I would recommend this hoover. I think it's really good for just like quick vacuums. It's got like a self emptying base. So at the end you'll see me pop it in the like charging dock and then it just sucks all the dirt out. So the Shark Detect Pro is one of my new gadgets that I've been loving. And this is the damp duster from Scrub Daddy. You can get it from like B&M and those sort of stores. But it's so good at collecting dust and then you just rinse it off under the tap. You love me better if I go I'm not home I won't know Can we trust the stars of
just also taking this opportunity whilst I'm child free to set up some Ziploc morning bags for my toddler with activities. This is one of the best mum hacks. I just set up a new activity each morning and this gives me a chance to get ready, feel put together. So many mornings during my motherhood journey have been a complete disaster. I've just ended up in my pyjamas, not got dressed, been so unmotivated for the day. So doing this has helped give me a little bit of time back to prepare for the day in the best way. Another day, another reset. I totally slacked yesterday. So today I'm really powering through. I've got 30 minutes and it's gonna be the most hardcore 30 minutes you have seen in your life. I'm even gonna do a deep clean of the dishwasher because there is something disgusting lurking in the bottom of it. I hoped we were gonna make it He promised we would find the time Dreaming for eternity Creating perfect memories yeah. We hoped we were gonna make it Little did I know the time Something I've added to my monthly cleaning list as well is just taking the cushion covers off and hoovering up the crumbs underneath my sofa because I literally <laughs> went probably about six months without doing it before and it just built up and it was just so disturbing that now I'm just trying to keep on top of it month by month and just also give the cushion covers like a rub over with lint roller and, and basically just keep on top of things so they don't build up. I've also accidentally uncovered a new hack for cleaning your sofas. If you go in with the fabric refreshener, I use the Febreze one, it just dampens all the existing dust that's sort of like built into your cushion and then go over the top with a lint roller. It just picks up so much more this way. So it's definitely one to try. Also makes your sofas smell banging. I've also been asked, how do you clean your lampshades? And the answer is using a lint roller. It's something so simple that so many people don't even like think of, but it just cleans all the dust and then I just use like a tissue or a cloth to, to actually clean the light bulb inside. Um, but a lint roller does the trick. So this is my air purifier and it's also got like a little um, storage bit in the top but this bit is really dirty so I'm actually just going to take this off. I've got a replacement one. I'm going to put this in the washing machine and then put a new like it's like a pre-filter it's called so it catches all the dust. Now I'm tackling a job I've never done and it's something that desperately needs cleaning. 
This is my pre-filter for my air dehumidifier. It is so dusty, I can literally see the dust every single day and it's really bugging me. And then I remembered I've actually got a replacement pre-filter. So I'm gonna whack this one in the washing machine and put the new filter onto it. This is a job that has been bugging me. I've been seeing it in the corner of my eye when I'm sitting chilling on the sofa. So I'm so glad that I've got this done and it will just make my air so much cleaner and fresher. Um, the weather's not quite there yet. I really hope it gets there soon, but when it starts to get a little bit warmer, I'm also definitely going just to be opening my patio doors, opening all the windows and let all the musty, crusty air from winter just leave the premises. So I'm really excited to do that and just give like a whole air refresh of my home. But like I said, we're not quite there yet. I'm hoping the warmer weather starts to come. lovelies i hope you're okay i'm just about to have a little bit of a break i've just paused the timer i'm gonna make myself hot chocolate um but i thought i'd just say hello and i hope you're okay before we crack on with the rest of the clean i just wanted to say this morning i actually went for a development review for arlo and i'm just feeling a little bit like <laughs> scared shall we say just a bit scared um the lady was so lovely and like she said to me that there are potential concerns there with like his behavior, potentially on the autistic spectrum or maybe ADHD. So she's sending me through a questionnaire to complete, to try and gather some more information. Um, we've also got an appointment booked in a couple of weeks time. She actually rang me to arrange it like an hour after I got back. She's been amazing and made me feel so much more reassured. Um, but that's just been on my mind the whole time that I've been cleaning, to be honest. But yeah, that's been on my mind a little bit today, so I'm just trying to clean, scrub my troubles away. <laughs> I do feel like cleaning definitely helps me and my mindset and just helps me to like, I don't know, it's like I saw something that's like when you clean, all of the voices in your head just stop and you just feel peace and that is so true for me. <laughs> bad I don't even know how to clean this I didn't even know this could come out this part This is a no judgment zone because I am very embarrassed to admit this, but I've never cleaned my dishwasher, nor did I even know these parts came out of it and should be cleaned. So if you're like me, don't feel bad. Like we just need to rectify the issue now because that is disgusting in there. And this dishwasher has been here like since before we moved in. So I, I dread to think how long this dirt has been festering in there, but I just caught a smell, like a whiff of just 
mouldy food and this is why because it's just been building up inside here i even found a pumpkin seed from um, halloween so i'm definitely just trying to like go in now with my sonic scrubber give everything a clean also going to give the dishwasher itself a wipe down spray with some white vinegar then whacking my steam cleaner out and just trying to spritz anything that i can see and i'm so glad that this has been done i do need to put on my shopping list though to get some dishwasher salt and rinse aid because this <laughs> this dishwasher has been out of it for a long time <laughs> Another job on my spring cleaning list is to clean my curtains. So these ones are looking very sorry for themselves. I tried to go in with the steam cleaner to see if that would do a good job, but it didn't. Um, there was some like mold at the bottom as well. So I was like, this is not working. So next week, the job for us to do is to take these curtains off and put them in the washing machine and see if all the dirt and mold will sort of disappear if we do that. Um, but that is a job for next week. I hope you guys liked this video make sure that you come back for next week so we can crack on with more deep cleaning i've got so many things to deep clean in time for summer so i'd love for you to join me i'm sending you so much love make sure you tap that like and subscribe button if you haven't already and i'll catch you guys in the next one